Okay, what if we don't call this? Okay, so it went back to if stun. Okay, so the reason for that okay, is because over here, okay, the revert animation goes back to moving. Okay, by default. Okay, since over here, after it has reverted, or after this has been caught, even if the animation has not been, it's not completed, it will still go back to moving, okay, due to all of these conditions being true. Okay, so we need to remove each one of these. Okay, and we'll set the exit time as okay, maybe two seconds. And we'll set if facing right as false. Okay, over here we'll do the same thing. Okay, we'll set the exit time as two. Okay, and we'll remove this and this. Okay, so we'll do the same thing for the other side. Okay, we'll set the exit time as 2. And we'll remove if attacking and if stun.
Okay, and that should do it. So now let's start the game again. Okay, to see the changes that we have made to the eye status animation. So now when we attack the ice turtle, it will stop going to its shell, it will come back, and it will start moving again. Okay, so the animation is now correct. Okay, but we need to decrease the delay here, so that it will start moving left or right again. Okay, and one more thing that we need to do is over here. We check for if this enemy is defending or rather not defending so that it won't take damage when it is defending. Okay, so we'll do the same thing over here. Okay, if enemy done, if defending. Or rather if not defending. Okay, let's copy and paste this whole thing over here and paste it over here. Okay, and that should do it. So now when the ice turtle is defending, Okay, you n will not be able to damage it. Okay, so before that, we will need to get to the ice stage or the ice world. Okay, by first clearing the brick wall. Okay, like what I have just done. Okay, so now when the ice turtle is attacked, okay, it will go into its shell and stop moving.
Okay, and when it is in its shell, okay, your attacks will not be able to damage it. Okay, so that's one more thing that we need to do if H Okay, so you might have noticed that even though it doesn't take any damage when it is in its shell Okay, the attacks that you do go past it Okay, and that is not what we want Thank you. 
Okay, so let's change that. Okay, by moving this out from the defending portion or section so that at least the Okay, at least the attack will be destroyed and not go past the turtle okay so let's test that now So what we are going to do here is Okay, we will not go into full screen mode Instead we will play the game like this So we can check that The Ice Turtle has not taken any damage When it is defending Okay, we we'll need to test that again using wave instead of impulse. So notice that the turtle's health is currently 4 So if I attack it once It'll be 3 If I attack again it's still 3 Now it's 2 Okay now it's 1 And it's still 1 Okay so when it is defending You will not be able to attack it
Okay, of course we'll need a different sound effect for when your damage for when your attack hits the ice turtle while it is defending. Okay, and another thing that we will need to add is that when it is defending, okay, it will be unable to attack you. Okay, so let's do that now. Let's go to the attack method. Okay, over here, where we call attack. Okay, if enemy type is... Okay, a defensive shooter. And if defending, okay, we will not attack if it is defending.
Hmm. Okay, what we can do is Okay, we could increase the duration of the defensive position. Okay, so at least the ice turtle will be defending for a long